it's Lon Seibin, and it's time for your weekly wrap up. I'm a little bit under the weather today with a, a bit of seasonal allergies kicking in, so hopefully I'll feel better tomorrow. The Claritin just isn't doing the trick. But we had a busy week in the family, so my production schedule got slowed down a little bit. My sister-in-law got married this weekend, and we also adopted a dog on Thursday. Her name is Sasha. You can see her behind me, and a little bit sooner than I thought, but uh, we learned of a really beautiful young husky that uh, somehow got uh, landed in the Hartford Dog Shelter, which is a kill shelter, and we really had to act quickly in order to save her. So uh, she's home, she's getting acclimated, and it's been a really uh, smooth transition so far. I gotta do a little bit of cleaning every couple of hours, but uh, we're getting the housebroken breaking thing going too. So really exciting and uh, very happy that uh, we did uh, make the move to adopt this wonderful animal. I think you should really check out your local shelter if, uh, if you are in the market for a pet. There's some really great dogs uh, they're just looking for a good home. So check them out. That's my public service announcement for the day. Uh, so I, I have a couple of videos that I shot but didn't edit. So that iShare follow-up where I uh, connected or try to connect it to a Windows 8 machine doesn't work. Uh, that's a spoiler. And uh, I do get it working with a MacBook using AirPlay mirroring. So I'll show you how that iShare thing works with that. I also did shoot the HD Home Run Prime follow-up where I kind of look at uh, my setup now and how it's working. And I think you'll all, especially if you found me because of that original video I did on the HD Home Run Prime, I think you'll find it interesting. It's uh, not a lot of new stuff actually because it's been working quite well, but I do show how I use everything together and it's really coming along nicely. I got some new stuff to talk about this week for the channel, which is, uh, you know, I've been doing a lot of interviews lately and some of those are rather long. They're like, you know, 30 minutes or longer and that's hard to consume on YouTube because the app doesn't play audio in the background. You know the whole routine. So uh, what I did is went out and created an audio only podcast, which you can find on iTunes and Stitcher Radio. Uh, just do a search for my name or Lon Seibin or Lon Reviews Tech, or you can just go to lon.tv slash iTunes or lon.tv slash Stitcher, and you can uh, find it on there. You can download it to your uh, mobile device and listen to it in the car or whatever. So if you wanted to check out those long form interviews, but didn't want to watch them on YouTube, now you've got an option. So check them out. And uh, hopefully this week, I'll be talking to Tom Kalinske, who was the CEO of Sega back in the 90s. He's the guy uh, that really made the Sega Genesis what it came out to be, something we all really were fond of of course, and uh, he really led uh, quite a team, did some really amazing work as the underdog and basically becoming almost the market leader during the 16-bit revolution. So we'll talk to him about uh, what went on during that era and maybe some things that modern game companies might be able to learn from what he learned during that period of time. It's going to be really exciting. I'm looking forward to talking with him. I also set up an email list. So if you go to lon.tv slash email, uh, you can sign up for a list that I'll probably send out once a week. So after I post the uh, weekly wrap-up, I'll send out a little email with all the videos that I did in the prior week, a little bit more reliable perhaps than that YouTube notice that you might get. And I also will probably do a, like a, an occasional thing where if there's some kind of breaking news, if I cover that, uh, or if there's a live event I want to tell you about, I will send out an additional email. But you probably shouldn't see more than one or two emails from me a week. And if you really uh, like what I'm doing and you want to check it out, um, go there. It'd be really cool to get your subscription. And I won't sell your email address or anything like that. Uh, just use it for me to communicate with you. New stuff this week to review. I'm still waiting on those uh, Acer K1 Chromebooks. I have them on order with Amazon. Uh, they just haven't come in yet, so I am eagerly uh, waiting that to come in and get it benchmarked. Uh, we're getting another HP Chromebox in uh, through the Amazon Vine program, so I'll start to do a little bit more with it. I'm going to try to shoehorn Windows on it if I can. i got to probably get a bigger uh, MSATA drive, so that won't be immediate, but uh, we will take it apart and see what's inside and see what you can do with the memory and that sort of thing, so uh, look for that coming up. I also have an HP Slate book coming, and that is a 14, I think it's a 14 inch uh, notebook computer, but it doesn't run Chrome OS, it doesn't run Windows, it runs Android. So it's an Android laptop, and I'm eager to see how that might work. It has a 1920 by 1080 screen, so a full HD screen, it's touch screen as well. Uh, so it should be kind of neat to see how Android fares as a full-fledged laptop. So that'd be kind of cool. And I also have the Elgato HD60. It's a little device that you can use uh, to record your gameplay. And it also puts your picture-in-picture uh, -picture window up there as well. So you can do like a webcam and a gameplay thing at the same time. Uh, they say it also streams to YouTube and Twitch in addition to recording onto your computer. So we'll check that out as well. So all sorts of good stuff to look forward to this week. Again, you can sign up for that email list at lon.tv slash email. If you want to help the channel, there's actually a lot of ways you can help it now financially. Uh, the YouTube, uh, I think they call it fan funding, just got active on my, on my channel. So uh, you'll start seeing it in the upper left-hand corner of my video. You can click on that, uh, leave a one-time contribution. You can also go to my channel page at lon.tv uh, to leave that one-time contribution as well. Or you can go over to Patreon at lon.tv slash Patreon, 
and leave a subscription-based thing where they uh, send, you know, basically bill you once a month uh, if you want to contribute a couple bucks a month towards the channel. Completely optional. I'm never going to do a paywall or anything like that, but I know a lot of you uh, did uh, want, you know, want to help me out because I helped you out, so I'm happy to uh, take some modest contributions, and we're always going to put those back into buying more things to review. So that will do it for this weekly wrap-up, and this is Lon Sybin. Thanks for watching.